Hey, my name is Tyler, owner of Switch Electric, here to show you guys the Enphase Ensemble storage system. We've been doing a lot of these lately. I'd say about 90% of our solar installs include storage, and Enphase is one of the most popular ones that we do. And we kind of want to show you a little bit on how these uh, storage systems work. So here we have uh, 30 kilowatt hours of battery storage. And what makes Enphase a little unique from the rest is that it integrates their IQ8X um, inverter um, that's special for the battery. And so what this allows is no high voltage DC wiring. The DC wiring from the battery goes straight to the micro, converts it straight to AC, and then out to your a panel for your home. And so what's also unique about this is say if an inverter ever goes down, you got one screw here to be able to take the inverter out and you can swap it out really easily, get it back up and running. But you also have four of these in here. So if say two inverters fail, you also have two more micros that are going to continue to keep functioning for you and delivering power for your home. So we think that's pretty cool. It makes the system very, very reliable in a worst case scenario, but also very easy to repair if it's ever needed. Each one of these battery modules here are 3.36 kilowatt hours. Um, what's also cool about Enphase's storage system is because it's modular, it's expandable. And so this customer only needed 30 kilowatts of power to be able to uh, um, feed all the loads in their home and to be able to sustain themselves and what their longest power outage would be. But you could add up to 40 kilowatt hours of battery storage if needed, or you could start small with just one 10 kilowatt hour battery and kind of build it as your budget allows. Um, and so this is what's really cool about this battery storage system. The other thing that's nice about it is the aesthetics of it. We think it looks really, really good too. You got a lot of battery storage going on here on the wall and uh, um, it doesn't take up a ton of space like some of the other competitors out there. And so we want to go around and, and show you the, um, the kind of the brain of the system to the end phase end chart or end power unit. And so we're going to go check that out right now. Outside, this is kind of the brains of, of the operation. This has the MID device that will seamlessly transfer power to battery storage if the grid fails. Um, what's also cool about this device is it has a generator um, input. And so you can do it a couple different ways. Um, we're a Generac dealer, so we install automatic standby generators for customers also, which, which allows us to install an automatic generator for the customer if they need it. So in our state, we're in Washington during the winter time, depending on how long your power outages are, varies on what city you're in. Um, and so if you get extended power outages, we normally have dark clouds in the sky. Solar's not producing a lot. Um, you may want to back up to that to be able to ensure that your battery stay charged. You can actually install a Generac or a Kohler backup generator to automatically start um, when needed, when the storage gets uh, too low. And you can actually set it to a point where um, say you want it to turn on at 30% um, reserve on your battery, it'll turn on and then turn off at 70%, um, but you can change that however you want. Enphase also has a built-in uh, quiet time mode where if you live in a neighborhood where the generator needs to be quiet, you can set a different reserve point, maybe say at 10% and uh, it will come down to before the generator starts. Um, so we'll open this up and kind of just show you guys what a little bit what looks in, uh, like inside of here. We have a few breakers. This is kind of where the generator breaker is going to get, get installed right here. Um, it's totally upgradable for this customer in case he chooses to have it in the future. Um, this Empower switch also has a neutral forming um, transformer. And so inside of here, it's required because we got micro inverters. They don't generate a neutral. So we got a neutral forming transformer that's built into this Empower switch to uh, be able to help power the loads inside the house in a grid outage. So this, this kind of wraps up the N-Power um, Ensemble system. It's definitely one of our favorites here at Switch Electric. We think it's kind of the ultimate backup protection um, between the batteries, having a generator function, and the solar on the roof. It covers all three major aspects to be able to keep your house powered up. Um, what's also cool though is it doesn't rely on that generator function. So if you integrate it, it's only starting it up as it's needed. So you don't have a generator that's running all night long that requires fuel. It's going to require less maintenance versus having a generator installed for your home that has to run the entire time to back up the loads. The last part that's really, really cool about this system is it when you do go in a backup um, grid outage mode, it does create a microgrid. And what that means is uh, the solar the batteries and the generator all work in parallel together. And so with the batteries having 30 kilowatts uh, hours of storage, um, and then this can put out up to about 48 amps of power, um, you could have a 20 kilowatt PV system up on the roof and those can work together to deliver, uh, to double the amount of amperage, you know, to, uh, for your home during the day when the sun is out. 
Um, but creating that microgrid, it also allows the solar to feed the loads in the house only while also charging the battery, um, as long as the, uh, the loads are supported by what the solar is producing on the roof. And so, so this wraps up uh, End Phases Ensemble system and uh, contact us today if you're interested in getting a quote. So we provide free estimates um, over Zoom or on-site estimates. Thank you very much for watching.